Sunday Times today reporting that summer is finally on its way with temperatures set to hit nearly 30 degrees Celsius in some parts of the country next week. And that's uh, thanks to a Spanish heat wave, which is uh, heading north towards us, which is good. Hello there. 15 hours of sunshine for some southeastern areas where the temperatures got up to nearly 24 degrees Celsius on Saturday. It was a little different, though, further north, as you'll see. We had a wet and a windy spell. We had nearly two inches of rain in the past 24 hours across parts of Scotland. Gusts of wind, 40, 50 miles an hour, quite widely, even as far south as the Thleen Peninsula of Wales. And that's because of this unusually deep area of low pressure, which is pulling away. So it's a glorious morning in some parts of the country this morning. Have a look at this. This is uh, right in the middle of London. That's the BBC building in central London uh, in uh, West One. That's uh, the, the church just in front there. Um, looks, looks very nice. Sun's up. Beautiful morning. Yeah, nice. clear, clear skies. Um, let's get a full weather forecast then with Chris. Um, Chris, the papers are claiming that next week it's going to be hotter in the UK than Hawaii. Can you confirm? Yeah, there's a reasonable chance. I mean, Hawaii would see temperatures into the high 20s and towards the end of the week, we could be hitting the 30 degree mark. It's the first time that I'm even thinking about using the word hot, Tina. So, yeah, it could well uh, get pretty hot for some of us, but not for all of us. There's always going to be a bit more cloud and some cooler weather across the northwest. OK, should we delve into the weather forecast? And it's been a, a fine start to the day. This was how Selsley started off with uh, largely sunny skies. That uh, weather watcher was sent in just in the last half hour or so. And I suppose it's a sign that uh, two weeks away is the longest day of the year so far. So, of course, the sunrise is long gone already. Later in the week, temperatures are set to hit uh, probably 30 degrees towards parts of eastern England. But before we get there, today across Scotland and Northern Ireland, we're looking at uh, rather cloudy conditions with some scattered showers. England and Wales, for the most part, it's dry. And with some sunshine, it's going to feel warm, just kind of like it did yesterday, really. And towards the end of the week, this area of high pressure just drifts a little bit further eastwards. And then we start to draw up these southerly winds, and it's that that will boost the temperatures. Towards the end of the week, we're looking at highs reaching the high 20s, even the low 30s across parts of England and Wales. But Scotland and Northern Ireland, well, here temperatures a little bit closer to normal for the time of year, but it'll still feel warm where the sunshine pops out. That's how things are looking. Roger, Tina, back to you too. Thanks, Chris. So flaming June is finally going to live up to its name. <laughs> Do you know, and it's the first hot spell. No, not everyone likes the hot weather, but I, I quite like it. I'm looking forward to a bit of heat, really. Yeah. First time this year. Absolutely. You uh, know what's... Yeah, yeah, thank you so much. You know what's going to happen? We're all going to be complaining that it's too hot next week. Yeah, I will yeah. be. We're a bit pasty. <laughs> <laughs> I'm always complaining Just about make sure you've got your sun protection. You'll be oh, fine. Yeah. Um, saved by the weather, I think, yes, is Chris. Absolutely. <laughs> Yeah, as long as I don't have to pronounce that Icelandic volcano, I think we'll be on a good one. Won't we? <laughs> yeah, remember that. Um, well, we've got some hot weather on the way. Uh, temperatures towards the end of the week by a country mile will be the highest that we've seen so far this year. 30 degrees on the cards for some of us as we head towards Friday. But uh, mind you, today, not a bad start across England and Wales. We've seen plenty of sunshine already for those early risers, but not everywhere. Chris is with us. That's a lovely blue sky. That's beautiful this morning. Yeah, it doesn't get much better than this, does it, for a June morning. This is Cornwall's Mausel, with uh, barely a cloud in the sky. Absolutely stunning start to the day. And there will be some warm sunshine today, but looking at the forecast through the week, it's going to get hot for some of you. 